So, friends, Jack Kerouac is known for his novel On the Road. On the Road struck a chord with the whole generation of young people who saw themselves reflected in a particular kind of angst, but also a particular kind of creative response to our collective and deadening anxiety. They saw in the novel an invitation to go on a kind of pilgrimage of transubstantiation. It's like Walker Percy wrote in the movie goer that this search is what anyone would undertake if they weren't sunk and asleep at the wheel in the everydayness of their own lives. And so the moment that a person becomes aware just of the possibility of the search, the curtain parts and new possibilities are fours. And just becoming aware of this possibility is to suddenly be on to something. And in turn, not being on to something is to be in despair. And so on the road speaks to a willingness to hurl ourselves off cliffs, to let it all die. And the faith in the redemptive power of a phoenix that might rise from the ashes. You know, Kerouac, he celebrated those restless souls who were crazy enough to believe in a new kind of reality and a new way of living. He said the artists, the rebels, the misfits, the only people for him, he said, were the mad ones. Mad to live, mad to talk, mad to be saved, desirous of everything at the same time. Those who never yawn, never say a commonplace thing. No, instead they burn, burn, burn like yellow Roman, yellow Roman spiders exploding like candles or yellow Roman candles exploding like spiders across the stars. The point is the ferocity with which these people live, the freedom with which they have the audacity to, to, in, to, to, to put into practice, you know? Well, it just takes our breath away. And uh, these people, though few and far between, in the end, they move the world forward. I think it was uh, Margaret Mead who said, never doubt that a small, small, passionate group of people can change the world. In fact, it's the only thing that ever has. <laughs> See you on the road. Uh, just another day at the office. The, the, the highway philosophy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just another day of highway philosophy. That's right. Just another journal in the bicycle diaries. That's exactly right. Just a, a willingness to entertain platonic discourse while in motion on a magic carpet ride giving rise to a subjective experience of fluidity, of transformation, of volatility, and also exaltation. A kind of runner's high for philosopher kings. That's right. That's right. Touche. Oh. Oh, yeah. Feel it in your body. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, fucking joyride. Just another joyride. Ooh, thank you. Thank you. I love you. I see you.